Pilot Drain Man here and today I have a very exciting video. In today's video we're going to be checking out this sub 100 gram mini cine copter. This little guy is so cool and it's so intricate and there's so much going on and you're really just going to have to take a, a close look to grasp the magic. We got all these mini copters and these micros and these minis and all this other stuff going on but what they don't have is what this guy does. This is a PLA connecting base with carbon fiber carbon fiber protectors all the way around it's under a hundred grams with the battery I think we were at like 102 I can't remember I'll put it up on the screen for you I got a Bosch two cell battery on there and this thing just rips it is so impressive it is so agile and what you want to put on here is you want to put on a stripped or naked O3 air unit that's what I did that's what's recommended and you can go with the ultra or you can go with the light Personally, I went with the light because I want to have SD card slot so I can record on board. If you're not into that, get the Ultra. Shred even more weight. Make this puppy even lighter so it flies even faster and even further. And the flight time is incredible. All the way around, I'm just impressed. You've got a nice carbon fiber dealio right here to protect your camera. It sticks out. Look at that. If you hit, you are safe. I did not use the recommended stack, so I did have some complications with the capacitor and with the XT30, but not a big deal. I just flipped it around, went the other way, and everything went together seamlessly. The build was an absolute breeze. I had onboard ELRS right into my stack, my beta FPV stack. I went with the 1102 14,000 kV beta FPV motors. They got plugs on the end. Talk about easy. You just plug them in and go. If you ever break one, you unplug it and put in the new one. So can't get better than that. As far as our ducks go, they are carbon fiber. So we are safe all the way around and protected all the way around. We don't have to worry about tearing up props. We don't have to worry about tearing up people if you want to use something like this because that's what makes this so special. You can fly it in and around people without a problem at all. And they're all safe. No one's going to get hurt. So there's a unique unique camera pod and vibration dampening design that locks the camera VTX and battery in a carbon fiber frame for jello free design and that is true I flew it myself and I'll try to show you watch this can you see that it's actually connected by 3d printing but it's carbon fiber to carbon fiber so everything is safe everything is strong but it's all nice and soft and smushy if that makes sense so with the built-in o3 you can do your rock steady but you can also jump into gyroflow and take it a step further if you want to do that or if you're shooting a professional shot or maybe you're going to drop that perfect little clip on the ig and you need that to be looking spiffy so with the versatility of this guy you can use it for cruising around and getting those slow shots or you can really crank it up and you can go for those fast shots those fast paced moving targets that you need to get and you got to get them with this guy and it can do them all but if you're cruising you can get up to six minutes on a 2s 450 right here with this little itsy bitsy guy i don't know if you're into the smaller stuff if you're not i get it but if you are or maybe you're stuck at home it's a rainy day it's a windy day i mean you can still fly this in the wind but on a on a bad day outside this is a great guy to play with inside my flight controller has the attachable USB-C connector, so you actually plug in a jumper, and that connects to the UBC USB-C connector, and that is how you'll connect a plug-in to get to Betaflight. So I went ahead and did that, and then I zip-tied it off here in the bottom, so that way I can just add later, make adjustments, do my tuning, stuff like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing about the owner of Spider absolutely awesome guy we text throughout this whole ordeal any questions comments concerns he even said hey drain man once you get this thing put together and you go flying if you need help tuning i got you i'm a pro with these things and that is awesome can't be better than that because when you buy a product you don't just want a good product you want good support behind that product and that is something i do believe is true with this company so i'm going to go ahead and put his link to his website down in the video description so you can check that out i'm also going to put a link of where you can go ahead and buy yourself one of these frames in case you're interested in shredding like a little monster and having some fun with the itsy bitsy spider <laughs> 
All right, pilots. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the build. I hope you guys enjoyed the flight footage. I hope that you guys had as much fun as I did. And I will see you on the next one. <laughs>